felt it again, my lord. Yet, I don't understand why this tremor is about the House of Valentine. I do understand now. I have no doubt anymore. It showed you the Valentine family because... This tremor has been caused by the offspring of Kadegar Valentine. Do you think the son of Valentine is alive? I am not thinking. I am saying it with great certainty. But that's impossible. Darth Maul murdered his wife and son decades ago. Apparently not. The baby survived somehow. Maybe someone saved his life and took him in. Then those people must be outsiders. Otherwise, this baby would be with us today. Indeed. And this tremor has happened because the power inside him has awakened. Hmm. This could be a great opportunity for both the New Order and the Lotus. You wish to find him and turn him to our side, don't you, Lord Phobos? The son of Valentine must not become a Lotus warrior. But if he could be turned, he can become a powerful ally. Yes, yes. He would be a great asset to the Emperor. However, it will take much time to find him amongst the thousands of star systems within the galaxy. I don't think we'll spend much time on it, my lord. How will you provide that? I have a plan. Alright, we better hurry. Stormtroopers will be here in less than 10 minutes. Let's hope the information we got is true. Uh, you alright? Mm, yeah. I just got dizzy. It's past now. Let's get to work. Looks like it's our lucky day. All the tanks are filled with quality fuel. I also searched for that crate. It's full of coaxium. That's good to hear, but we can't take them with us. We don't have enough space for them in the ship. So get to work! Here they come! Their response times haven't slowed down a bit. The fuel crate. We can get all of them in one shot. Have you lost your mind? If this thing blows up, we're all dead. Let's start doing more work, please. All right, we're clear. Yes, Tali, you can come back. I'm on my way. Tell me this is a good day for us. Best day in your life, sweetheart. Best day in your life. <laughs>
With this much fuel, our fleet can stand a chance. Alright, the barrels are getting filled. Hey guys, do you guys hear something? I didn't hear anything. It sounds like a speeder. It's just your imagination, lizard. I swear I'll kill this kid. Guys! What the? Who are they? They look like pirates. Boss, what should we do with them? We don't negotiate with anybody. Kill them all! I don't think they want to share the fuel with us. No, you think? Are you mad? You almost destroyed the fuel tank. These guys are no laughing matter. Just keep shooting, we can beat him. Jaina, I think that tank is depleted. Start draining for another one. It's a bit hard when those pirates are shooting at us. I got this. <laughs> Enough! I'm going in. I don't just bite, I eat my enemies. Fress, watch out! Uh -oh. It's gonna explode. Everyone to the ship, now! Now! I'm a prisoner. I haven't decided that yet. Maybe I'll keep you here forever. Or kill you here, right now. Or give you a chance to redeem yourself for the fuel we lost because of your friends. What makes you think I'll help you? Do you have a choice? No, I don't. Boss, I say let's put him in the airlock. Yeah, he would only slow us down. Let's just kill him. No. I want to see his skills. Come with me, kid. I want to have a conversation with you. Fine. Why don't you kill me now? I'm useless to you. <laughs> I don't think you are useless. Otherwise... Why would you carry this? Ugh, damn it. Where did you find this lightsaber? I took it from a Jedi corpse. You should try practicing lying sometime, because you're bad at it. I won't ask again. Where did you find it? Why would I tell you, huh? Boys. Ah, uh, fine. It's my lightsaber. I'm a Jedi. Well then, we would like to see a demonstration from you. Lift that object. No way I'm doing that. Boys. You prefer to be alive? Or prefer your brain to be spilled all over the floor? 
Hey, guys. Chill. We can always work things out. Then amuse us, boy. Use the Force. Be my guest. Fascinating. Go ahead then. Go contact the Empire. They'll kill me and you pirates will be rich. What makes you think I'll contact the Empire? Do you think we are pirates? Then enlighten me. What are you? We're rebels. We're the renegades of Apocalypse. Why should I trust you? You're a Jedi. You can't sense that I'm not lying, can't you? Very well, then. Rebels. What do you want from me? You and your friends owe us a lot of fuel. There is no need to tell you why we need it. We need it, too. And we were there first. Finders keepers. That doesn't matter anymore. You owe us. I'm afraid it doesn't work that way. And I'm afraid you don't know how things work here, Jedi. Change your tone. We don't need to fight. I'm glad you think the same way. Then you can help us in our operation. What operation? We're planning a riot at an Imperial City on El Sock 3. But what connection does your damn fuel have with a riot? That fuel was for destroying some Imperial weapons, not for our ships. Because of you, our mission will be hard unless a Jedi helps us. But this fuel could be used for rebel ships! Other rebellions don't concern me. Now go, and prepare yourself for a riot before I throw you out the airlock! Fine. I'm ready for your goddamn selfish rebellion. Don't misunderstand our grim leader. He's got a good heart. Oh yeah? I think you're talking about the wrong person. Have you thought about how many people could die in this rebellion? <laughs> What about Drexel? He's the angriest man here. None of us know what the Empire did to him, but no doubt it's worse. <laughs> we do have emotions, but we don't let them control us. Your emotions are clouding your judgment. I don't think destroying an Imperial factory is possible with our lesser numbers. Factory isn't as big than you think. Also, we have a kind of advantage which we can turn it against them. What kind of advantage? This city has a huge reactor in the central building. But what do you want to do with it? Blow it up? Not blowing it. I'll divert all reactor's power to the factory so it will blow up. How many people will die? I mean civilians. No civilian casualties. Only stormtroopers and droids. 
This is one of the rare factories that's automatic. Okay, here's our plan. We will split into three groups. Sebastian and I will take first squad and raid the central building. When the Empire sends their forces to the building, the second squad will attack the factory. The third squad will take some of the walkers as much as you can. We need to protect both buildings and the factory as things will get really ugly real quick. Then let's get this show on the road. Don't get comfortable so soon, boys. Bucketheads will be here soon. Here they come. Ah! This is gonna be fun! There they are! Blast them! Squad 2, advance! Right away, boss! Second wave will come soon! Until then, let's take a breather. It'll take a while for them to come. Until then, let's check out the reactor. How did he die? What? Your master. How did he die? He was defending me against stormtroopers. How classic. Here's our reactor. I'm still wondering how you're gonna overload the factory by diverting the power. Relax. I was an engineer on Naboo. Naboo, huh? So you're from Naboo? Don't need to be a genius to know what the Empire did to you. That doesn't concern you, Jedi. Boss, we got a problem. What is it? Walker's incoming, and I don't think there are men. What the hell are these guys doing? Third Squad, I thought you guys would steal those walkers. You must have them, boss. We don't have seven minutes. Hurry it up. I'll go down to help your men. That'll buy us some time. Good thinking. Go!
I thought Jedi are professionals about these situations. I'm a slow learner. We're all gonna be toast if the backup doesn't come to enough! We have them now! Keep firing! They arrived just in time. I'm gonna go check on Drexel if you guys can handle this. Sure, go check on him. He better leave the building soon since we'll blow up the city. Wait, wait. What did you just say? Didn't he tell you? We'll blow up the reactor. It'll take the whole city, but the factory will be destroyed as well. Oh no. I assume the plan is going well, huh, kid? I heard the rejoicing from here. You lied to me! About what? You didn't tell me about destroying the whole city! Oh, yeah. You wouldn't have helped me if I told you the truth. Yeah, I wouldn't. I won't allow you to destroy the city. Too late, Jedi! Already executed the overload sequence! Thousands of innocents will die. How can your heart bear that? Do you think those people were innocents? They only care for themselves. They should die too, since all of them support the Empire. You should know that not all people support the Empire. On the contrary, there are many people who hate the Empire, and all they need is hope. Do you know what the Empire did to me? Tell me so I can know. I once had a loving wife and a beautiful daughter. After the Clone Wars ended, the Republic became the Empire. After months, our Queen rebelled against the Empire, and they came to invade my homeworld during the invasion. The Empire destroyed the purity of my homeworld. They murdered my wife and my daughter! I do know how you feel. You cannot know this, Jedi! You had no parents! I know your kind have no emotions! You're wrong. And honestly, I'm not a Jedi. I'm just some guy trying to learn the Force. Me, my father, and my friends... were trying to escape from prison. My father didn't make it. I hate the Empire. But I don't hurt civilians like you do. Think of everything that will happen if you kill innocent civilians. More people will support the Empire. More people will hate rebels. It will make the fight for freedom harder for other rebel cells. Is that what you want? Other rebellions don't concern me. All I want is revenge. Then you are truly gone. Rebellions don't kill the ones that have to be freed. You're no better than the Empire. Look at you. You're acting like a terrorist instead of a freedom fighter. What would your wife and your daughter think about you if they were alive? Mm. Fine. But it's too late. We cannot stop the overload sequence. You said that you can divert power to somewhere else. What about diverting some power to the factory, enough to blow it up, and disabling the reactor? Perhaps too many ion charges can disable the reactor after the factory is destroyed. Good thinking. Squad 1, get to the reactor room now, and bring some ion charges. Squad 2 and 3, prepare the ship. We need evac now! We brought ion chargers as you ordered. Is there a problem, boss? Yes. Plans changed. We will disable the reactor. We can't let innocents die. What about the factory? 
We'll divert overloaded power to the factory to destroy it. Then, we will disable the reactor with ion charges. We don't have much time! Hurry! Cutting power from all buildings now. Diverting all power to the factory. Now! All clear. Showtime, boss. Now activate ion charges. When we're out of range, you know what to do. Thank you, for making the right choice. No, I thank you for opening my eyes. For two years, I had nothing but revenge. <laughs> you may not be a Jedi, but you acted like a true Jedi today. Thank you. Glad I managed. Join us, kid. You're a great warrior. You can be useful to us. Thanks, guys, but my family needs me. They're probably looking for me right now. That won't be a problem. We'll take you to them. Those Inquisitors give me the creeps. Yeah, me too. Is there a problem, Trooper? Oh, um, no, sir? Did you find anything? Nothing, but laser burns and some dead corpses here. Trooper. Sir! No evidence about those insurgents yet? We're searching for security records, sir. With luck, we will find some evidence. There is no such thing as luck. Sir, I think we found something. Must be nothing more than smugglers. No. These are the rebels I'm looking for. Seventh Sister, Grand Inquisitor. Did you find anything on Corellia? I did. Those insurgents? are the Jedi I encountered on Kajim. Are you certain of this? I know their faces anywhere, Seventh Sister. Do not confuse me with someone weak as yourself. <sighs> Enough, both of you. Continue your search, Inquisitor. Alert us if you find them. Understood. Please forgive us for that mess on the train. My mind had been in a dark place for a long time. But your friend here has... What? What's it called? Um... Redeemed you? Yeah. He redeemed me, sort of. <laughs> alright, alright. Apology accepted. It is a great favor that you brought Sebastian here. Thank you. What'll you do now, Drexel? We'll do what we always did. 
And kid. Yeah? Whenever you need help, you can call us. All rebels gotta look out for each other, right? Thank you. I see you're learning. I wasn't learning already? Not really. Hey. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm glad the rat returned home. <laughs> Me too. Who would we annoy without him? <laughs> ha ha ha. Very funny. <laughs> Let it go. They annoy you because they love you. I would love a Mandalorian more than a lizard. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> You okay? I don't know. I've been like this the whole day. Maybe you should rest. Maybe I should. Go sleep, my dear. You need it. I hope I can be fine until the next operation. What operation? Do you remember that we destroyed the spice factory? That job was only phase one. Now, it's time for the second. Looks like we could all use a nice nap then. <laughs> <laughs>